Diabetes has been known for a long time as one of the major risk factors of stroke. So a patient with diabetes would have two or three times higher risk of stroke than those who do not have diabetes. And uh, diabetes can cause a lot of changes in the brain, uh, especially the vascular changes. It can cause atherosclerosis, it can cause small vessel disease, and in some cases, even some uh, changes in the brain itself. So, yeah, having a diabetes is, is bad for, for the brain, especially, yeah, having stroke. And patients with multiple risk factors, including diabetes, would have higher risk of, of stroke even more. So, uh, in the old days, we believed that treating diabetes uh, by lowering, lowering the sugar will not affect the risk of stroke. They can prevent some some microvascular complication, but not macrovascular. But just recently, we have newer newer anti diabetic drugs. So those drugs have have been proven that they can reduce the risk of stroke, like GLP one receptor agonist, or some of the drugs that we have right now. Uh, it has been clearly shown that they can prevent uh, stroke as a primary prevention and also a secondary prevention. <laughs> 